In this episode, we're gonna explore the question, how can I crowdsource data using Google Sheets? You may or may not have seen it yet, but we have our community map, which is actually driven by a Google Sheet. What this means is every time this map is refreshed, it actually pulls data from a Google spreadsheet and then brings that into the map. This can be a great way to allow a large number of people to edit the underlying data by giving them access to edit it in Google Sheets while not having to train a large number of people on how to use Kumu. So what does this spreadsheet look like? If we click on this link, it'll take us out to that spreadsheet. You'll see it's formatted in a uh, typical Kumu import format. So you need the same format in here. But once you do that, you can actually set up an import in Kumu. So let's walk through this by actually creating a copy of this. We're gonna delete some of this content. So we just have a bit of that to, to walk through this example. Uh, and then we're gonna share this so that anyone can have the link. Essentially, there's two ways of doing this within Kumu. You can make it so you actually share directly to Kumu the user, that's our private version, or you can change this so that anyone uh, with the link can see it, and that's what you're gonna need to do um, to be able to use this within Kumu. So let's copy the link. We'll come back here, let's create a new project. We can pick the stakeholder template and then come down and click this green plus button to do an import. Choose Google Sheets and then just paste our public sheet right here. When I click link, that'll walk you through the import review step and then when you click save, you'll now see that data showing up in the map. Um, just to give you a quick example of how this works, we can switch back to this Google Sheet. If I was to add Jim Stone here and say Jeff Moore. Once we save that, as we switch back, we can refresh the map. That's gonna fetch the latest data. And now we'll see a new person showing up, Jim Stone.